The Guinness Book of World Records contains all sorts of achievements, like the longest fingernails or the biggest hot dog. But today, the only thing we care about are football records. So what we're gonna do is build a brand new team using this video called 12 Players That Have Guinness World Records by Oh My Goal. Ever wonder what Lionel Messi has in common with Nicholas Bettner? Every day. But we're too scared to ask? Yes. Well, you're about to find out. All right. Because these are just two names on our list of 12 footballers who have broken a Guinness yes, World Record. Yes, Lewandowski, my Ronaldo goat. Ronaldo is obsessed with being number right, one. Ronaldo is everything. gonna be our first to player. What record he did he break? He has more world records than we can count. These he has more than one. include scoring, more international goals than anyone else, more Champions League goals than anyone else, and more La Liga penalties than anyone else. Pen merchant comments incoming. He's also the most liked man on Facebook. How old is this video talking about Facebook? Anything Cristiano can do. All right, wait, hold on. Before we get into the next player, let's go buy Cristiano Ronaldo. Now, as you may or may not know, Ronaldo has a ton of different versions of his card. And I thought, let's start off this team with a bang. So I'm thinking, let's grab his team of the year version. Let's just hope it isn't too expensive. So the cheapest version of Ronaldo on the market right now is 3.4 million. So let's pick one up. Boom. Now, the card's position is center mid, but for now, we'll just leave him at striker. Let's go get our next player. All right, Messi. Anything Cristiano can do. Let's Lino see what records he's broken. As well. Unlike his Portuguese nemesis, Messi lets his football do the talking. That is which true. Which is perhaps why he holds the record for the most goals scored in a calendar year. And how many a is that? staggering 91. 91? And we're pretty sure that tally doesn't include the ones he scored on PlayStation. Messi is also the most prolific That looks like Pez. I don't even... <laughs> that's FIFA 21. That's, that looks like Pez. assists than any other player and has won more Ballon d'Or This is true. He does have the most Ballon d'Ors, man. Amen. Let me know in the comments right now. Are you Team Messi or are you Team Ronaldo? I need to know. Now, with the year Messi has had, he doesn't have as many cards as Ronaldo, but he still does have a Team of the Year card, and I think we need to get it. It's only fair. 1.76 mil. Get into my team. I think this is the first time I've ever had Team of the Year Ronaldo and Team of the Year Messi in the same squad. This is looking pretty good so far. All right, Lewandowski next player. Another player who likes to produce Robert Lewandowski. And I think I know what this is all about. That time in 2015, when he scored five goals in nine minutes for. I remember that game like it was yesterday. Bayern, the best bit, he did it as a substitute. Uh huh. This that's my goal. This smashed four Guinness World Records simultaneously. Four? I thought it was like two. I do not know if ever a player will succeed in what I achieved. Damn the cockiness. No, no, for modesty then, right? no, not the TikTok video. They really had to put this in to humble him. Now, Lewandowski doesn't have that many cards either in this game, but he does have a team of the season and a team of the year. And I think we should switch things around and actually grab his team of the season this time. I don't want to just have every card a team of the year in my team. He's only 427K? What? All right, let's grab him. Boom. Now, as a huge Lewandowski fan, I'd rather have him as my striker rather than CR7. So we're going to switch those two. Now, let's go get the next player. Not all records are about yep, scoring Ederson. goals. Just ask Manchester City goalkeeper Ederson. Okay. Who is now the man with, wait for it, the world's longest drop kick. Who wouldn't want that on their resume? The Brazilian managed to okay, launch the ball a whopping 82 point. We need a goalie in this team, so I'm, uh, we're going to accept it. All right, so Ederson might have a world record, but he actually doesn't have any other version of his card apart from his gold version. So that is the only one we can get. I think it's only like 30K, so I guess I'm saving coins. Boom. All right, let's hope we can get a defender into this team because apart from Ederson, all we have are attacking records. Before anyone says anything... Dele Alli did not break the record for the most consecutive games spent on the Tottenham bench. He actually... Man, this commentator is just dissing everyone out here. Holds the record for... All right, Dele Alli is next. nutmegs in 30 seconds. Damn, who, who counted it? He performed this feat on former teammate George Kevin Nakudu. Keyword, former teammate. The man left after this world record happened. Back in 2017. Ali put the ball through his colleague's legs eight times in 30 seconds. Damn. The one caveat is that Nkudu was made to stand stock still with his feet apart for the duration. I can literally go and beat this record right now, but I won't. I'll let him have it. Let's go buy his card. Now, this year, EA did drop a flashback Dele Ali as an SBC of, like a month ago or so, and I kind of regret not completing it because it has been a pretty cracked card when I've played against it. However, the next best thing is his Adidas Numbers Up card, which is like maybe 40k. It's better than his gold card, so let's go buy it. Boom. Martin Palermo's club career saw him become Boca Juniors all-time okay. leading goal scorer. But All things right. didn't go quite as well for Argentina, which is why he holds no, the record for most penalties missed in an international no. game. In a <laughs> Man, I think this is the worst world record to hold. I, I swear. What, what else would be worse than that? 1999 Copa America defeat to Colombia. 
Palermo managed to fail with three spot kicks. You know, I think after the second one, it should have been like, okay, someone else shoot. Like I expected, he's not in the game. So let's uh, maybe just get an Argentinian icon. We don't have a defender yet, so we might as well get like Zanetti or something. So 285k, get into my team. Boom. Liverpool hotshot Mane. All right, next Often up, Sadio Mane. The guy on the other flank at Anfield. Back when he was a Southampton player, okay. Sadio was the man. Okay. And that was never truer than on the 16th what of he May, do? 2015. Wait, no, I know what he, he did. He scored the hat trick. Fowler's 21 year record. For 21 years it was held. Premier League hat trick. It took Mane just 176 seconds Damn. to complete the round. I can't even score in 90 minutes, and this guy scored three in 176 seconds. So Mane has a bunch of different cards. He has a team of the season. He has some informs, and he also has a road to the final card, right? I didn't really think he was that expensive. I thought he might have dropped a little. His team of the season is like, what? Three mil? No, that's not right. It's got to be a little less than that. But like still, I only have 2.1 mil. I wanted to use this team of the season, but I think we're going to just use this one. What is this? Domestic man of the match. Boom. I've literally just realized it tells the next player up in the right corner here. It literally says Bettner right there. So I guess this isn't really much of a surprise. Good sense of self-worth. Or Lord Betna. That he is finally been is that, the world's what is he, most Danish? That's not really. Impersonator. It's not really but a Danish he accent. he actually holds the record for... Fastest goal as Fastest a substitute, goal as a substitute. In the okay. It took All right. Bentner just six seconds to hit six the target seconds? in the North London Derby in December 2007. <laughs> and to be fair to Damn. the day, it was a pretty good way to make an entrance. All right, yeah, he's not in the game. All right, so he did it for Arsenal. I guess we can just get an Arsenal player. First option, Tierney. I think that's a perfect player for us. 87 pace. It's good enough. Boom. Expecting this one All right, to have something Rooney. to do with most swear words ever uttered in an Everton shirt. But you'd be wrong. Because these what what is that horse thing? Why is he wearing that? Do you okay, you know what the record that. for the most consecutive appearances on the cover of Damn, FIFA. I didn't know that. Rooney I actually didn't know that. Every game from 06 to 12. Damn, was did on he the really? Australian version from 10 to 16. I think we'll put Rooney in the team and then maybe Cahill on the bench. We already have so many attackers. Boom. All right, and then our first bench player is Tim Cahill. Boom. You know what? Chemistry is actually coming along pretty good. We we just have Lewandowski with no links, but he's good enough. You might be expecting this one to have something to do with preventing goals. Another goalie? It's quite the opposite, because Casillas actually holds the record for the most goals scored from the halfway line. What? The he actually does? I didn't know that. 11 times in 60 seconds during a televised challenge in China 2011. I thought he did that in a game. This also oh, Chinese TV show? Come on. All right, he's going on our bench. He doesn't deserve the starting 11. Boom. We're still missing two defenders. I hope there isn't many more attackers. Brian Sessegna. Ooh, he's, yo, he's a defender. We can use him. Time to hit both posts and the crossbar. It took him just 7.75 seconds. Did and he do that in a game though? Or like, who's controlling these world records? I'm actually getting, I'm getting kind of ticked off here. Boom. All right, we need one more bench player and then a center back. Let's see what happens. We can't oh, Inaki Williams. What do you do? Bill Bowes in Yaki Williams. Wait, he, he had a record breaker took the card crown for most last year. Consecutive appearances. Nice. That's a big achievement. To be precise. That's a huge That's almost achievement. That's five and a half years. What? Five and a half years. 79K. Get into my team, Inaki. Boom. Let's look at our last record-breaking football. All right, last player is Samuelson. You've never heard of I have Samuelson. not. And I have not heard of him. It's probably because someone sent you the video of him breaking the record for the world's longest headed goal in a competitive game. He was inside his own half. It's hard enough kicking it. Inside his own half? I have not seen that video. I got to check that out. It's quite something. I've done something I'm never going to do again. I don't know if anyone's going to do that again. So cheers to him. Let's go buy a Norwegian center back. All right, let's choose Norway position center back. Let's see what pops up. All right, so first one already. The only gold card. Ayer, and he's from the Prem, Brentford. We might as well buy his card and then he'll get some chemistry for us. So I think that's the perfect, perfect card for us. Now the team is complete. And I thought as this is a world record team, we should set our own world record, right? It only makes sense. So I think what we're going to do is get the most expected goals and the least amount of actual goals with this team. And we're going to do it in foot champs. Now, I think the easiest way we're going to do this is by just getting very good chances and then absolutely blasting the ball. Yes, here we go. Yes, there we go. That is definitely an expected goal. This guy's probably like, what is going on here? Ronaldo? Yes, another expected goal missed. That's what we need to see. Lewandowski's through. Here we go. Yes, 
another one. It's too easy. All right, it's half time. Let's see how many expected goals we have. 2.3? He has the same amount as me? It's going well, but we need way more. That's the ball. Huge chip. Yes, okay. I thought, honestly, it was going to go in. It's going extra time. That means I have more time to get more expected goals. It's a win-win right now. I'm guessing I have like five expected goals right now. Three? He has more than me. But you know what? Maybe the record is going to be shared between us. There's seven expected goals and it's zero, zero. Here we go. Nice. That has to be another expected goal. Here we go. This is going to be it. Yes! We've done it. That's definitely the world record. 6.1 and 4.4. We just got it. That's 10 expected goals and zero goals against. I think that's a world record. And if you enjoyed this video, you'll enjoy this video right here.